Deliverable D. Integrated Report on the Contribution of Feminist Theory and Conceptual Framework. August 30th, 2023. Work Package WP, TUD, Conceptual Framework, Gender Justice in a New Age of Democracy. Responsible Team, Nikita Doan and Anna Maria Miranda Mora. With contributions from Vera Belashitskia, Lara Zwitlinger, Monica Kovacs, Nico Virix, Zazana Vidra, Carlos Sara Castells, Lydia Bueno Sanchez, Laura Lot Medina, Magda Sorota, Barbara Helfrich, Valentina Maglietta. This project has received funding from the European Union's Horizon 2021 Research and Innovation Program under Grand Agreement and Degree 10106-1687. Views and opinions expressed are those of the authors and do not necessarily reflect those of the European Union or the European Research Executive Agency. Neither the European Union nor the granting authority can be held responsible for them. About push asterisk back asterisk lash. Project Summary The goal of Push Asterisk Back Asterisk Lash is twofold. Firstly, to systematically inquire into the present day contestation of gender equality issues and policies at both elite and citizen levels. Approaching democracy from a global feminist perspective, we employ a rigorous, comparative, multi method design, example, experiments, surveys, interviews, participatory theater. Our project enables a identifying anti-gender strategies as well as best practices in counteracting them across space and time, and b assessing the effects of anti-gender discourses by focusing on parties, social media, and public opinion. Secondly, to develop and test strategies that can effectively counteract anti-gender and anti-feminist discursive strategies, aiming at supporting the quality of democratic governance in more inclusive European societies, we acknowledge intersections between gender and other social categories at all stages of the project, composition of consortium and advisory board, theory formulation, empirical investigation, and policy recommendations, and thus engage with stakeholders. To develop sustainable solutions, we bring together gender activists, EU experts, and researchers from several fields of political science, political theory, public policy, political parties, public opinion, political behavior, anthropology, communication and media, philosophy, sociology, and social psychology. Push asterisk back asterisk lash is a transdisciplinary, gender-diverse consortium aiming at equipping pro-equality actors with practical toolkits for responding to anti-gender equality and anti-feminist discursive strategies and backlash tactics. Table of Contents About this document methodology Introduction, Gendering Democratic Theory from an Intersectional Perspective I. Anti-feminist and anti-gender backlash and democratic backsliding. 2. Feminist analysis of democracy. A. Normative democratic theory and liberal democracy. B. Gendering democracy. 1. Citizenship. 2. Participation. 3. Representation. C. Contemporary feminist analysis of democratic theory. 1. Ecofeminism. 2. Social reproduction theory and care ethics. 3. Queer and trans feminism. 3. Intersectional inequalities. A. Global inequalities. Eastern and Western European inequalities. B. Gender inequalities and intersectional feminism. 1. Black feminism. 2. Postcolonial feminism. 3. Feminist disability studies. 4. Roma feminism. Or Democratic pushback and gender justice in a new age of democracy summary of findings. V. Literature 62. About this document. Description, Integrated Report on the Contribution of Feminist Theory, Including Modern Feminist Frameworks, An Intersectional Analysis to Democratic Theory in the Context of Anti-Gender and Anti-Feminist Movements and Conceptual Framework, M. Executive Summary, The Report is Structured as Follows, I. The first part gives an overview of current anti-feminist and anti-gender movements, backlash theory, and democratic backsliding to briefly map the current challenges and problems facing scholarly, activist, and policy efforts towards gender equality in Europe. 2. The second part delves into feminist approaches to democracy against the background of a genealogical and normative analysis of democracy within the framework of liberal European democracy. This part reconstructs key feminist arguments and criticisms of liberal democracy and offers alternative tools to transform it from within. This part is divided into two sections. 
The first one reconstructs some prominent classical ideas and theories of Western and non-Western feminisms for the engendering of democracy in three main fields, citizenship, participation, and representation. The second section discusses significant contemporary feminist democratic frameworks, such as ecofeminism, social reproductive theory and care ethics, and queer and trans feminism, which broaden Western notions of democracy by advancing new concepts and perspectives. Three, the third part provides an intersectional understanding of gender injustice in the context of global inequalities, specifically Eastern and Western European inequalities. This section engages with the crucial contributions of different feminist traditions to intersectionality theory. It reconstructs the vital contributions of non-Western feminist theories to intersectionality politics, such as black feminism, post-colonial feminism, feminist disability studies, and Roma feminism. For, finally, the fourth part explores the project of a feminist pushback against the anti-feminist and anti-gender backlash for a new age of democracy. The final section engages with gender justice as a utopian concept and the normative dilemmas that beset a new age of democracy. Feminist democratic critical ideals of citizenship, participation, and representation reshape and inform alternative concepts of justice by reimagining democracy through the lens of intersectionality. Summary of Findings Key Findings of the Feminist Diagnosis, Critique, and Transformation of Liberal Democracy 1. In the face of the backlash against gender equality sought by anti-feminists and anti-dash, gender movements, parties, and policies, the European Union faces an erosion of democracy and democratic backsliding. 2. Western and non-Western feminist scholarship and activism seek to challenge and transform political discriminatory and exclusionary structures and practices and promote gender equality and gender justice in democratic practices and processes. 3. Western and non-Western feminist theories of democracy encompass a range of approaches that highlight the gendered dimensions of political power within democratic systems. 4. While feminist theories of democracy can vary in their specific emphasis and approaches, some central concepts feature prominently such as citizenship, participation, and representation. 5. A feminist theory of democracy seeks to empower women politically by making their membership, participation, and representation efficacious and promote their active engagement and influence in political processes. 6. Foregrounding gender equality recognizes that women have historically been marginalized and excluded from decision-making processes with the aim of challenging and transforming these power imbalances. It is not sufficient to have women in political positions, their presence should also lead to meaningful changes in policies, priorities, and decision-making processes that address women's concerns and interests. 7. Feminisms from the Global South challenge the reified notion of women as a group with shared experiences. They object to the universalization of the Western idea of state, society, and politics, highlighting local gender and racial power relations and dynamics. 8. Black, Roma, post- and decolonial feminist theories of democracy challenge and aim to transform liberal democracy in Europe by questioning its Eurocentric bias. 9. Gendering democracy means a substantive practice of democracy understood as one, a form of government that protects and enforces values such as pluralism, non-discrimination, tolerance, justice, solidarity, and equality. 2. A political regime that commits to pluralism. 10. Effective and extensive democratization is unattainable without substantial citizenship, participation, and representation. 11. Feminist contemporary analysis of democratic theory engages with an intersectional approach, transnational perspectives, political economic questions, planetary and environmental concerns, social reproduction and care ethics, and the challenges and possibilities presented by technology. 12. A feminist intersectional analysis of democracy studies how gender intersects with other social categories, such as race, ethnicity, class, migratory status, and disability, to produce specific forms of inequality and discrimination within democratic practices and processes. 13. Feminist approaches from both the global North and South emphasize the importance of expanding participation and inclusivity in democratic processes. 
They argue for a participatory democracy, which fosters the active engagement of marginalized groups and subaltern subjects in decision-making and policy formation, creating spaces for diverse voices to be heard and fostering a more inclusive and representative democratic grammar. 14. Critical feminist theories not only emphasize the reform of liberal democracy but further a radical transformation of its historically biased concepts and practices into alternative views of democracy. The new age of democracy is understood as a form of government and a political regime informed by gender equality and gender justice, which implies redistributive and transformative justice in a politics of recognition and representation. Key findings of the feminist analysis of inequalities and justice from an intersectional and global perspective. 1. The differences in the historical development and political economy of the various countries of the EU must be considered when studying and comparing them. 2. To better understand inequality, it is imperative to focus on the co-constitution of multiple categories such as race, ethnicity, class, gender, sexuality, disability, migratory status, and religion. 3. Intersectionality as a traveling concept has made remarkable contributions to feminist scholarship and activism. It helps to understand the current challenges of transnational feminist scholarship and activism. 4. An intersectional approach to gender inequality focuses on gender-based discrimination, power relations, and the interconnected nature of different forms of oppression and discrimination, seeking to rectify them. 5. Intersectional theory acknowledges that individuals can experience multiple intersecting systems of oppression and privilege simultaneously and that these overlapping identities and experiences shape their lived realities. 6. Intersectional politics significantly contributes to the analysis of and struggles against inequality. This framework helps to understand the complexities and contingencies that characterize the coexistence of domination and resistance. 7. For intersectionality theory, the goal is to rectify historical wrongs and empower disenfranchised groups whose experiences have been previously disregarded by single-issue politics and policy approaches. 8. Intersectionality in post-colonial studies identify and examine the flaws and shortcomings that structure the asymmetry and non-reciprocity between feminisms from the global north and south and outline the challenges of transnational feminist alliance building. 9. Intersectionality in feminist disability studies foreground the importance of people's experiences for scholarship and how these insights help challenge oppressive hegemonic discourses and structures. The bridging of theory and practice functions as an essential political tool that helps reclaim alternative forms of identity and personhood that are not framed by ableist norms. 10. Intersectionality in Roma feminism reveal the deep inequities between Western and Eastern societies. They explain how the intersection of gender, ethnicity, class, nationality, and migratory status impacts women's vulnerability and contributes to the ethnicization of gender-based violence, thereby reinforcing racist and patriarchal structures in transnational contexts. 11. Intersectional analysis and politics contribute to engendering democracy and spaces of democratic participation by identifying the mechanisms and relations that produce specific forms of inequality and discrimination within democratic practices and processes. 12. Feminist approaches to democracy acknowledge that although the role of rights cannot be underestimated when it comes to mitigating gendered vulnerability and discrimination, law does not always guarantee justice. Contemporary feminists challenge existing legal systems, advocating for transformative justice approaches that address gender inequality and violence and ensure accountability and gender justice. 13. Normative arguments for advancing gender justice are confronted with backlash and backsliding that beset a new age of democracy. 14. Feminist, democratic critical ideals of citizenship, participation, and representation reshape and inform alternative concepts of justice by reimagining democracy intersectionally.